Hi guys. Today again, it's a Sunday and myself and Arush, we came out for a small off-roading and a lot of time I was trying to share with you people that many of my friends from YouTube and from my workplace were asking me that why you are doing this kind of adventures, right? Don't you have any fear? See, adventures are meant for overcoming our fear, right? What is a fear? Fear means a situation where we are afraid of. And you can say it as an unwanted situation. We don't want to face it, right? Then what is adventure? Adventure is taking or daring to take such fear and overcoming it. Then what happens when you do that? See, when, uh, when we do that, when we take some uh, adventures uh, to overcome our fear, what actually happens is it transforms our personality, right? A person who is very shy, a person who is uh, 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 very, uh, very much reserved or who is not social, who is feared of or who is scared of meeting people, uh, going to places, uh, doing some unusual jobs like adventures, uh, or even uh, th these kind of people don't take up sports also. So, the main thing is you have to overcome that fear. That means you have to win it, right? And when you do these kind of adventures, you definitely win and definitely there will be a transformation in your personality and you become capable of doing a lot of things, right? Sometimes what happens in your workplace, uh, if you are being assigned with a work and you are scared of doing that because you don't know. You don't know how to do that. That was your first time. Maybe, maybe your first time. So what happens? We generally ignore it or we say refuse it or we don't take such kind of jobs. Which may be uh, sometimes uh, closing the gateways for your development. Right? No, it should not be like that. So I always believe that you have to take up challenges. You have to do things that you have not done already. So that is what I believe that when you overcome that kind of fear, you win, right? And for that, this is the best strategy that I follow. I do this kind of off-roading, right? As a passion, as a hobby, as a skill development. See, because you know, my Jeep is a two-wheel drive Jeep and it is not capable of full off-roading. But still, I take a lot of challenges with this. Even I don't know whether it, gets, it will get struck or it will come out of that obstacle or not. But I do believe in myself. I do believe in my Jeep. I do believe in the capabilities. And I perform that. And what happens? Believe me, guys, whenever I do off-roading, there is a little fear in my heart. But along with that fear, there comes a courage and I believe in, that, believe in that courage and with that courage, I overcome my fear. Now you could have seen some kind of uh, off-roading that we have already done. So take a look on that. Stop telling people how to run their business. It's my life, take it or leave it, set me free. What's that crap of an old all? I got my whole life, you got your own life, leave your own life and set me free. Mind your business and leave my business. You know everything, Papa know it all. Very little knowledge. Stop for me, please stop for doing me, stop for giving me, stop for sending me, stop fighting me, stop yelling me. It's my life. It's my life. It's my life. Stop telling people to run your business Take a trip to be somewhere So you find out you don't know anything Everybody's getting tired of you Sometimes you have to look and listen You can even learn from me Little knowledge is dangerous It's my life It's my life So you beg, so you lie, what you see, 
is what you get. Listen to people like something sad. Things I do, I do them no more. Things I say, I say them no more. Changes come once in life. Stop forgiving me, stop bothering me, stop forgiving me, stop forcing me, stop fighting me, stop killing me, stop telling me, stop seeing me. It's my life. It's my life. I just tried, I did myself, and I learned. Now, I can, I, at least up to an extent, I can train some people in off-roading and how to do, what to do, what not to do, and all these things. Now, this is what the courage I have developed, right? I teach, and my qualification is PhD. Just I'm sharing with you because uh, you might think that what a professor is doing with off-roading why a PhD should do this kind of adventures? I ask, why not? Is there something that defined that professors should not do all these kind of things? Nothing. I have found my own way of coming out of stress. I have found my own way of coming out of fear to win the fear. And even I have done lot of other stuffs also. Just see in this video.
hope you saw that all kind of adventures i used to do whenever i get an opportunity i don't miss it i just do all this kind of uh, stuffs because i believe that a person should not hesitate i, I mean uh, a person should not hesitate to do something because of fear if he is not interested then things are different but only because of fear he should not hesitate to do thing so i just believe that we should not avoid things due to our fear just overcome your fear guys get transformed do lot of adventures enjoy your life bye